everyone, and welcome to another episode of Randy Prizzle's Lincoln Ting with me, Randy Prizzle. I'm back in the dark. Yes, I'm back in the dark. Feels good to be back in the dark under a red light. You do all the Star Wars vibes and feeling and all that. But anyway, let's not get into all of that. You know, we're usually here for the linking and the tinging, so let's get on to it. If you're feeling this episode, you know what to do below, all of that. And yes, let's go for the linking and the tinging. We come to Maria Victoria. Two names there, it's all cool, all fine there. So yeah, let's get on to what she's saying. I'm the type of texter who sometimes responds, sometimes doesn't, according to the planetary alignment and retrograde Mercury and opposed Saturn. It's a, I don't want really to know all that planets, you know, all that yada yada stuff. Do you know what I mean? Respond and don't respond. Yeah, that's a bit flaky at times. Do you know what I mean? We want you to respond. Well, I do. Not so we. Don't know who's we. But I want you to respond when I'm sending you a text. If you're spending your while and you're just thinking about what to contemplate and you're just basically taking the biscuit and not really trying to get back to man as soon as possible, ASAP, then you are taking the pee. Do you know what I mean? And that's what I'm saying there. And it's not nice when you're leaving someone hanging and, you know, they kind of tell listen, all right, fair enough. If you're working, whatever, you, you're busy, cool. Do you know what I mean? But, you know, within the time you finish and you're constrained to whatever you're doing, a little text aside, oh, sorry, I can't talk right now, something like that, just to let me know what's going on. Do you know what I'm saying? Then leave a man in the dust and not say nothing, and I'm feeling like I'm going to rust, you know try to just make rhymes that doesn't don't don't watch that but anyways let's move on to more what she's saying she's 33 five seven she's an illustrator good so she knows how to draw i'm a draw myself so you know all good there says random facts i love is butterflies remember being a caterpillar do they that's good that's a good fact then good good facts butterflies remember being a caterpillar, you know, so I remember when I was a sluggish little crap and you know moving along and couldn't do much, and then they bloomed and knew how to fly. Do you know what I mean? They got away and they flew away from being a little slimy piece of worm. So well done to them, you know. They did the Lenny Kravitz stuff. I want to get away. I wanna fly away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what they did. Well, you know, like uh, Haley and uh, Eminem song. We could be doing night airplanes in the night sky, like shooting stars. I could really use a wish right now, wish right now. With yeah, all of that. So yeah. Okay. Can not. Oh, she's unusual skill. She says, can not a cherry stick using my tongue only. Well, that doesn't mean you know she then got it. You know, doing the. <laughs> This stuff, do you know what I mean? Uh, is that is she good at that? Is that what she's trying to imply? Do you know what I mean? But anyways, let's move on to uh, something else she's saying. She's not saying anything else. Apart from all that, you know, the tongue tying with the, the stick ting doesn't really impress me much, like Shania Twain. So it's going to be a no for me. We come to Valerie. Why won't you come on? Well, not come on over, Valerie. I don't actually want you to come on over, to be honest, because, you know what I mean? Personally, right now, let's see what she's saying, and we can decide at the end of that. You know, right now, it seems very peaky to me, like the blinders. All right, my simple pleasures. Your order has been shipped. Emails on the same day I made the purchase. That's cool, but um, you know, and it's good to hear because you obviously want your orders coming in time when they don't. It's feel like they're doing crime, in it. Yeah, I'm trying to make rhyme. Yeah, that, that rhyme. Yes, dope, dope, dope. All right, uh, she's thirty. She's five three. Liberal says. Um, she says, "Give me travel tips for Japan." Don't know. I've not been there, so I can't tell you. Don't know what to tell you, like a leader in it. Don't know what to tell you. Don't know what to tell you. So yeah, I'm convinced that everyone that likes sparkling water is lying. Well, yeah. Listen, I like it when it's mixed with the fruit drink. So I'm more into it when it's mixed in the Rio sort of sense. Because Rio is actually sparkling water with I don't know a bunch of fruits in there, and it's it's really really sexy stuff. Total sexy stuff. Sexy kiss. It's so sexy. I'm telling you, when you just see it, it's buff. Do you know what I mean? Buff. Buff. Just buff. That's the word that only comes to mind. Because it is, and that's all I've got to say there. 
apart from all that, I don't really want to Valerie to come on over as I said earlier, so it's going to be a no for me. We come to Lorna. Lorna says the best way to ask me out is by with a grand gesture that was only sociable, acceptable in the 90s teen rom coms. We're not really in a rom com state, are we now? But you know, like trying to do all that thing, like, yeah, would you be mine? Like, lady, can you can you be mine? Like, I, 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 I want to get to know you. Like, you know, so me and you together, we can, like, make something happen. What you think? Like, is it totally cool if I get your number, maybe? Or, uh, you know, I uh, try and move to you in a different way, so maybe you can accept what I'm bringing to the table, you know, something along the lines, you know. But anyways, she's 27, 5'11", she's a nurse. Cool. We got two of the nurses in the NHS, just doing their jobs. Um, she says, I'll pick the topic if you start the conversation. If you can have the answer to any question, what would the question be? That's, that's definitely one to think about. That kind of caught me off guard, you know what I mean? So, you know, I'm a little bit like, hmm. Answer to any question. Doesn't seem one that's coming to my head right now, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, that's deep. That, that's probably for another time. I'm going to have to get that to probably a lot of you on that one. And it might be in another set or in person. Because right now, I can't think. So, so someone else has caught me out on this right now. They have. Well done to you. You don't win anything. That's what I'm saying. You don't win nothing. You've caught me out, but you don't win nothing. Qualities I'm looking for in a plus one wedding date. Can match my cringe-worthy dance moves. Cringe-worthy. Cringe-worthy. Cringe... Ah, start again. <laughs> can match my cringe worthy moves on the dance floor. That's good. I mean, I can dance, I can throw a few shapes, I can cut them on the dance floor. I'm not going to do the cringe worthy stuff. I can obviously show you how to move so you look better on the dance floor so people go, yo, that girl can move, yo. She got the vibes, yo. No, you know, she got cool stuff. She really going in, you know. They're going in. Like, you know, the um, Roll Deep song. No, it wasn't real deep. It was Skepta's crew. I said, boy, better not. We're going in. We're going in. Yeah, all of that. So, yeah. Um, apart from that, it's going to be a no to Lorna from me. We come to Chevy, like the Chevrolet. Chevy, she says, we'll get along if you're honest, real, have loads of banter and time. No time wasters, she says. She don't want no time wasters. So, she wants no time wasters. Say that, that, but she doesn't want any. So you're honest, real. Have loads of banter. That's good. Do you know what I mean? I think definitely that's that's good to have. Someone who has banter, honest, and you know, gives it straight as they can give it to you. You know what I mean? Straight as a needle, or straight as a knife, as straight as a point. I don't know what else is straight, but you know, as straight as me. You know what I mean? Straight. You know what I mean? So yeah, giving it to you as straight as possible. So yeah, she's 34. She's 5'2". She says, I work. That's all you need to know. That's good enough for me. You know what I mean? You, you, we want to know that you work. Do you know what I mean? Or you have something that you're trying to push towards. There's something along those lines. Listen, all right, now it's a bit peaky for me. I'm not going to say sitch, but you, some of you all know. You don't really need to explain much. But, you know, I'm out there and I'm still trying to make things happen and all of that. So, yeah. Cool. We move on to the next thing. She says... The one thing you should know about me is I'm too real and honest for my own good. I like Marmite. Oh, hmm. oh, she says I'm like Marmite. You either hate me or love me. You will take things to heart, or we will not get along. Jeez, could be peaky like the blinders, couldn't she? Do you know what I mean someone's gonna probably giving you some hard punching stuff? Do you know what I mean like, like a punch in the chest and all of that? Do you know what I mean make you? Your heart not beat again and stuff like a uh, JLS and all of that. Ding 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 and my heart won't beat again, beat again, killing me. 
So yeah, the heart went big and all of that, do you know what I mean? Gives you a raw good punch, and then that punch is going to be tasting like Marmite. Oh gosh, that's not good, is it? Not good at all. Okay, she says, together we could be superheroes and save the day. I'm Rogue, X-Men. Who would you be? Hmm, I need a real man around here. If I could compare myself to a superhero, which superhero I'd probably like to be, uh, I'm trying to think of a natural person who has the natural abilities, because I'm a natural you know, superhero fan, you know. So someone like Batman, you know what I mean? Just get the money, boom, 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 put the suit on Iron Man as well. Do you know what I mean? One of them, man. That's kind of what I would like to be in general sense, because I wouldn't have to use my powers. I just have to use a suit. Obviously, in Batman's case, you do training and you put a suit on and then boom, you kick out. But even in Iron Man's case, you'll have to kind of learn and get your body proportionate to be ready to go to fight. Do you know what I mean? So, yeah. One of them ones. That's where I'd be. Um, yeah, apart from all that for Chevy, I don't really want to drive her, so it's going to be a no for me. She probably will drive me crazy. Ooh, ooh. And she went to the Tottenham Stadium as well. Ugh. Ugh, disgusting. That's a definite no for me. Don't want none of that. Gosh. Ugh, to think I nearly went over to Tottenham for that one. They well, it wouldn't say yes to us. So, you know, I, I escaped that, thankfully. Because, boy, that would have been real, real problems there. Definite problems. What's when you're having the motor mouth and then you, you're a Tottenham fan? Oh, gosh. You're talking a lot of stuff that you should not be saying. All right. My favourite line... For, well, we'll come to Megan, sorry. Forget her, she's done. We come to Megan, my favourite line from a movie. He then proceeds to order an arista. Blah blah, let's just, yeah, whatever. He then proceeds to order an aristotle of the most ping pong tiddly in the nuclear sub. She says, from lock, stock, and two smoking barrels. I actually haven't seen much of that film, so I, I don't know where the line came from and who said it, so I don't know what to tell you there again. Like Leo, I don't know what to tell you, don't know what to tell you. So yeah, she's 27, she's a woman, she's an engineer at Blackfriars. Uh, she's, she's, there's a picture of her with a couple of women them, good, good. She says, the key to my heart is water. She's swimming. Beach, kayaking, windsurfing, diving, surfing. She wants to learn it. Kit surfing, she wants to learn also. Don't know what kit surfing is. I don't really seem to heard of that one. But all oh, that sounds good. She likes the water stuff. She has to get wet and wild, don't she? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Splash waterfalls and all them thing there. You know what I mean? The ludicrous song. If you, if you know what I mean there. But yeah. All right. I'll fall for you if you know your Louis Armstrong to your blues brothers. Well, I do know Louis Armstrong. We're on ding ding ding, ding. the time in the world. Nothing more, nothing less, nothing more, only love. That's definitely gonna hurt my throat later on. Shouldn't have done that, but hey, it is what it is. Bing, 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 bing. So yeah, that sort of stuff. Apart from all that, Megan, I, I don't want to really have all the time in the world for Megan, so it's going to be a no for me. Alright, we'll come to the last one, Annie. Annie, like the kid Annie from the film Annie. So yeah, she says, fact about me that surprises people, I can complete a Rubik's Cube in under three minutes. Well, ain't you smart? Ain't you a smart cookie? Yeah, it explains why you're a nurse as well. You're definitely smart. Rubik's Cube in under three minutes. I can't bloody do it. Takes me after about an hour or two. I've chucked the thing away. I have no time for it anymore. Do you know what I mean? She's 31. She's 5'3. As I said, she's a nurse. Big up to her. She says, I'm overly competitive about Monopoly. I've been banned by more than one person. That's a great story to tell, isn't it? You know, banned from Monopoly. That means she's cheating. She's taking stuff from the bank. She's cheating like my man rides his song. Yeah, you know, she's cheating. I think she's cheating. Yeah, all of that. Do you know what I mean? It's not good. Not good to be cheating. You know what I mean? Like, 
Monopoly is a game where you just have to play the game like Triple H. And if you're not playing the game like Triple H, then it's not time to play the game! <laughs> when he spits the war on, all of that, you know, yeah, all of that. But yeah, um, that's mad that she's been banned by one person, but you know, it's all about the game! And are you playing? All about the game! All about that, take it! So yeah, but you know, it's literally all about the game! <laughs> but yeah, I'm actually legitimately bad at dating apps. Listen, I, I am as well. This is not really worked out for me much, is it? But then I'm giving entertainment to Heo. So in the sense of Heo, it has worked for them because they're seeing all the mishaps and all the misshapes and all of that stuff without me actually throwing shapes on a dance floor or anything like that. So it is what it is. Do you know what I mean? And yes. Well, uh, apart from all of that, it's going to be a no to Annie from me. And that's all we have time for on this episode of Randy Prizzle's Lincoln Ting. I'd like to thank you all for tuning into this episode. If you're feeling this episode, you know what to do below, all of that. And you know what we usually do here when we finish. Link out! Link out! Link out!